So basically, uh, we are for the first time here in IAA, uh, and basically here we are displaying mostly HCV products, truck products, trucks and trailer products. So uh, you know there are quite a new technologies that we have displayed here, which are few of them are EV uh, technologies where we have reduced the sounds of the bearings, the high RPM bearings that we are introducing to the market. There's a lot of topological and metallurgical improvements that we have done in our bearings. So all those products have been displayed here, all the new technologies, including the new range of products where we uh, have introduced ourselves in the synchro set business, clutch, uh, the whole clutch business. So all that has been displayed uh, in the expo. So uh, what I believe is at this point of time, European market is uh, slow, but we have been adding products in the European markets at uh, a very good pace. So for us, it has not been slow. We see a huge potential with the European market. And, uh, 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 you know, we believe that uh, European market has a lot of scope because our presence was less. Now it has been increasing. So for us, European market has not been a decline, but it, is, it has been a growing story for us. And it should be the case in the ne next couple of years. Now, we, we, we have our own design testing facility, best in class, whole test trick department where we, you know, uh, uh, test the component as per the actual uh, scenario in the on the roads. So all that we do it in house. We are not uh, uh, doing build to print parts, something like that. So we get the inputs from the customer and we design the products as per the requirements or the life expectancy of the customer. So it's around, uh, you know, for the clutch release bearings, the market share here, we have less and now it is increasing in a very good way. Uh, the wheel end units uh, is a huge potential uh, with the commercial vehicle here. That is what we are focusing. The synchronizer set business, we have a patented technology where no, nowhere in the world, uh, you know, is the stamped technology being developed in the synchronizers uh, uh, for the manual transmission. So that has been done by us, uh, which, is, uh, which is, you know, nowhere built to print. It's completely patented. It's like stamped uh, synchro for the first time in the world. Absolutely. So at this point of time, as we are an indigenized company, so uh, the cost advantages are, of course, there along with the techno technological advantages. And we believe uh, there is a lot of potential where the European customers are looking for the substitute of uh, Chinese uh, manufacturers. So Indian uh, manufacturers has a huge uh, opportunity in the area where everybody is looking for an option B uh, than uh, a particular country. So that is where the opportunity lies uh, for us and we believe that we'll try and capture as much as possible. So we believe, first of all, OEM is, is our target. So once you are proven in the OEM, the aut aftermarket automatically follows. So that is has been our strategy even in the Indian market. So we try and uh, uh, help and work out with the OEMs as, mu as much as possible. Aftermarket is aut automatic. So that is where the focus is. As far as the aftermarket is concerned, the focus is, as I said, uh, on the OEM. We are uh, trying to add on the teams here in European market to cater our OE, uh, OEM customers in Europe. We have quite a few. We are wanting to add quite a few. So uh, in both ways, we are going to add uh, some resources uh, and uh, you know uh, uh, the transport logistic uh, networks here in uh, Europe. It has turned out to be good, even though the market is not the best in the world at this point of time, but the response has been fantastic. So overall, uh, it's a good uh, place to be.